Oh boy. Okay. 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 So there's some something was added clutter and miscellaneous. So let me go to mod installation part two. Scrolling down, looking for clutter and miscellaneous. Right here. And just dragon claws a right here. All right. Let's find it here too. Type in clutter. Clutter miscellaneous party two five eight. Okay. Yep. So something tells me it's gonna be replacing JS Dragon Claws SE. All right. So let's go ahead and install the new updated version of this mod. Files. What are we doing? Okay. So there's gonna be a full mod here. We want the 4K version. That's a third option here. Yeah, you can see right here, we're going to remove the old version. All right, so now that's downloaded, we can close this out. And let's look at the full mod. Let's get to it. Okay. So let's look at this for the first section. Like I said, Dragonborn, display, cup up. Yep, leave that as is. Leave Worm's Tooth. Okay, we're going to leave everything here alone. Click Install. I should have taken note of that priority position. Let me just type in Dragon Claw real quick. Okay. Position 275. So we actually want this to replace that. So let's type in 275. All right. Let's clear this out. Activate it. Right click. Send to priority 275. Okay, now let's go up to 275 and see where everything is. There we go. That's where you want it. And let's look at these instructions. Sorry, we're done adding. Now let's remove what needs to be removed. So we're removing the uh, Dragon Claws SC. Right click, remove mod. Yes. And then removing all the patches. Because all the patches now are integrated into uh, Dragon Claws Anniversary Edition. So we're going to move Amethyst, Helga, and Conric. Yep. So start with Amethyst. Right click, remove mod. Yes. Helga and Reborn patch. Remove mod. Conric's accoutrements. Right click, remove mod. Like I say, the Dragonborn. Right click, remove mod. And Worm's Tooth. Right click, remove mod. All right, that's done. So we remove those, and now we're going to remove Landscape as an. Okay, Vivid Landscapes all in one. We already have better textures in the guide. Okay, so let's find Vivid Landscapes. Filter down here, type in Vivid. There it is, Vivid Landscapes all in one special edition. We're just gonna remove it. Right click, remove mod. Yeah, let's clear this filter. All right, let's look at the updates. Uh, Cathedral Weathers and Seasons was updated, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. Let's find it here first. It should be at the top, right? Yeah, here we are at the very top. So, so we're going to install the main file and the update file. So I'm going to go ahead and clear this out. Okay. So let's go and download those. We've got the main file, the update file. That's weird. I mean, it's updated. So why do we have to, oh, well, this update must have been released immediately. 16 October, 18 Actually, you know, we may already have this, the latest version installed. Let's look at Cathedral Weathers and Seasons 232. 233, no, it's not updated. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and install it. So let's install the main file first. Make sure that matches with Cathedral Weathers and Seasons. Okay, we're going to replace. There's a BSA. We are not going to extract it. No. And then let's install the update. We want that. Since it's an update, we want it to, uh, we want it to match. So click OK and then merge. And we're not going to extract a BSA. OK, 233. We are now updated. All right, cool. Let's clear this filter and let's look at what's next. Max mess mesh fixes, sort of mesh fixes. So let's scroll down until we see mesh fixes right here. Assorted mesh, mesh fixes. Okay. 
Miss, let's see if we actually need it. Assorted. Mesh fixes version. Nope, we do not have the latest. Okay. Let's go ahead and install that. That's not the one I want. We want assorted mesh fixes. Let's go to files and then download the main file here. Okay. And let's install it. We want those names to uh, match, and they do. Okay, then replace. All right, that is now updated. Clear the filter. And what else? City, retexture, skyland, solitude. See if we need it. Skyland, solitude. We're at version one. So chances are we are going to have to update it. Yeah, version 1.6. Okay. All right, I'm going to type in control F here. <laughs> I'm just going to type in Skyland. There it is, Skyland Solitude. Okay, let's click download. Files. And yeah, download the main file. All right, let's install it. Make sure those names match. Okay, merge. Okay. That is updated now. Moving on. Clutter of Miscellaneous High Poly Project. Let's see if we need to. High Poly. Poly. There we go. High Poly Project. We're at 4.95. We need to go to 5.3. Okay. I'm going to type in a search bar here. High Poly project right there. All right, let's install it. Download it. Files. <clears throat> Download the main file here. And let's install it. Once it's done downloading. Okay. Let's look at the full mods. So install everything. Next. Next. Firewood snow fix campfire patch and then install it. Actually, let me start over. I didn't double check to make sure the names matched. All right, the names do match. Okay, install everything. Next, Firewood Snowfix Campfire Patch install. Then click replace. Now, having done that, let's look at these special instructions. Right click on High Poly Project, open an explorer, and let's go into Meshes, Clutter. And we're going to delete the candles folder. Okay. And also now we're going to go into wine and we're going to delete wine bottle O2B, wine bottle O2B. Yeah. Now let's go back up. Let's go back to the mesh layer. Click on meshes. Let's go into furniture and we're going to delete the cart folder. Okay. That's done. Okay. Hi Polly is now good to go. Water, realistic water two updated version. Definitely need to update this. And let's find it here too. Realistic water too. There we are. Yep. Okay. So let's just follow these, these instructions. Download it. Files 4.01. Yep. That's all we need for that page. Okay. Well, now let's install it. Double click, make sure those names match up and they do. So let's look at the full mod. All right, next, next. We want to use smaller water drops and extended ambiance. Install it and then replace. All right, having done that, we got to delete some stuff. So right click on Realistic Water 2, open an explorer, go into textures, Effects, FX water droplets, tiles, FX water droplets, tiles, and we want tiles, control clicking, underscore less, and BRT. So FX water drop, drop ripples, tiles, tiles less, and tile BRT. Delete those. All right. Realistic water 2 is now sorted. And now the patch hub. We've got to update the patches. Okay. That's right here. Very next one. And we can see those patches right here. We already have that up. Okay, so we're going to, uh, yeah, 
version one versus version four. Okay, let's download those. So we want false scar and worm's tooth. So false scar 4.0. Yep, mod manager download and worm's tooth. Okay, now let's install those. Let's start with doesn't matter because we're just matching the names, right? So false scar. So we want those to line up. Or let's go at worm's tooth patch. Yep. Okay. Replace. Now the false scar patch. Okay, so as right now it's not named correctly, so drop down. There it is right there, Realist Squatter 2, False Scar Patch. Okay, replace. And those are now sorted. So for mesh fixes, patches, unofficial material fix optionals. Oof. Added special uh, installation instructions, so maybe it's not necessarily an update, just some additional steps that we need to do. And I already forgot what we're fixing here. All right, I'm just going to unofficial material fix. That's what we're looking for. Sit in there. Oh, okay. Mesh patch for various mods, main. Oh, no, we're here. An official materials fix optionals, right? Yeah. And these are just special instructions here. So first off, let's see if I have, uh, if we need to actually update the mod itself. So on official mater material fix optional. So we name these as different things. All right, unofficial material, high poly project patch and stunning statues. What version are we at? I have no idea because their version numbering is just strange. All right, just to be safe, we're gonna reinstall those bitches. So let's go ahead and do that. So download files, optional. So high poly project patch, my magic download. And was it stunning statues? Yeah, stunning statues. Let's download that. I have a feeling that we didn't need to, but eh, better safe than sorry. All right, stunning statues patch. Make sure those names match up. Okay. Let's get the full mod. We want the EMB meshes, default cape, reduce glow, install, replace. And let's do the high poly patch. Okay, that does not match up, so drop down. We want the high poly project patch. Now it matches, okay, replace. Now let's look at the special structures, delete the following folders, and we're looking at the high poly one. So right click on high poly project patch, open and explore. So we're going into meshes, clutter, and we're deleting the shrines folder. Okay, that is now sorted. Whew. All right, now we're looking at trees, flora, enhanced landscapes, oak standalone, added special installation instructions. Okay, so let's type in oak standalone down here. Oaks standalone. Okay, there it is right there. And we're going to do the same here. Oaks. Version 2.1, version 2.1. Okay, so we don't actually... Um, yeah, we don't actually have to update the mod itself. We just got to do the special instructions that were added. So right click, open and explore, go into meshes, and we're deleting the Dindalod folder. Okay. Okay, okay, that was easy. Next up. Choose floor, enhanced vanilla trees. Enhanced vanilla trees is right there. What about enhanced vanilla trees? Updated without version change. Ooh, how sneaky. All right, so here I'm just going to type in vanilla trees. There you go. All right, so let's go ahead and install that. Files. Looking for enhanced vanilla trees 4K. Should be one of the main files, right? Oh, here it is right here. All right, let's go ahead and download it. All right. Go ahead and install it. Make sure these names match up, and they do. So let's look at the full mod. Next, next, next again, next again. We're gonna go with darker. 
Next, next. Custom trees large. Next, next. Now what do we got here? SFO version one vanilla. We're gonna keep that. Snow pine branch textures. We're gonna go to third options. Scroll down. Miscellaneous. We want everything except firewood. Uncheck firewood. Next, next. We want both of these options. Next and next again. Greener pines. None of these. And then install and replace. So was there anything else here? Added special instructions. Yes, she did. It's right here. No, wait a minute. There are no special instructions for enhanced vanilla trees. What was that talking about? Oh, oak standalone. I was looking at the wrong thing. Oh, I guess I just skipped oak standalone. All right. Oh no, we did that. I'm I'm having a brain fart. One of those moments. All right, we're good. Let's move on to realistic aspen trees. Updated special instructions. All right, where is the aspen trees? Realistic aspen trees. Here is the special instructions. Let's see if we need to update the mod itself. Oh, let's type in aspen. Okay, version three point six. Three point six. We're good to go there. So we just need to follow these special instructions. So right click on realistic aspen trees. Open in explorer. Uh, okay, we already we delete the meshes folder, so I guess we're following the textures here. So textures, terrain, and we're deleting the lodge in folder. Okay, all right, that mod is now good to go. Aspen cheese, realistic aspen. Lawbringer was updated. Type in lawbringer. Red version one point two. We're updating it to version one point three. All right, so let's find it here. Lawbringer, there you are. So let's download this. Files, my magic download. Okay, now let's install it. Make sure those names match up. Lawbringer, Lawbringer. Okay, get the full mod. Next, next. We don't want that. We don't want Mara's Eye Den. Next, we're going with Bleak Falls Tower, Pine Falls Bridge. Next, and next. We want Pine Moon Cave. Next and next. Okay, we want Bleak Wind, Cradle Stone, Dragon Bridge, Lost a Valley, Moldering Ruins. Next and next. We don't want any banner textures. Next, next. And here we want Ruins of Bathalft and Shores Watchtower. Next, next. Snow Point Beacon. Nope. Next, next. Nothing here. Next again, we're gonna stay radiant exclusions. We're gonna exclude vanilla. Next, next, and that's it. Click install and replace. All right. So Lawbringer's updated. Locations and Gorge Robbers Gorge was updated. In Gorge Robbers Gorged. All right. I'm gonna type in robbers down here. Oh, this is the very next one. And let's locate it. In our mod organizer two rubbers. Whoops. Okay. We're at version 1.02. Yeah, we need to update it. So click download, go in the files, mod manager download, download that. All right, double click. Make sure those names match up. They surely do. Okay. And replace. Okay. Version 1.1. Yep. 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 Clear that out. All right. Now that's done. All right. Where are we at? White run watchtower doesn't start broken. Added instructions to clean mod. All right. So we're not necessarily updating it. Updating it. We're going to clean it. But I'm going to double check. Type in white one run space watch. All right. Let's go back into the guide. White run. Watch tower doesn't start broken. Right, yeah, we're not updating the version. We just need to clean it. All right, so let's clean it. Drop down to SSE edit. Quick auto clean run. All right, so now we need to find no broken white run tower. So in the filter here, I'm going to type in no broken. There it is. 
Tick the box next to it, click OK. This should be pretty quick. That is done. We can go ahead and X out. Very nice. Okay. All right, so now we got some reordering. Clutter and miscellaneous rustic amulets was pushed down to new clothing and jewelry. So, first of all, let's find it here in Modernizer 2. Clutter. Well, no. Rustic amulets. Rustic amu. There you are. 291. And it's moved to new clothing in, in part four. Okay. All right. Let's go to part four. And I'm going to type in rustic amulets. There you are. And it's directly after new jewels for circ uh, circlets and rustic clothing. All right. So I'm going to remember where this is. It's in 291. Now let's find uh, rustic clothing. So I'm just typing rustic. That way we got amulets, which is at 291. Rustic clothing. That's right, all the way down there, 687. Okay. Okay. This, this is what we're going to do, Mike. We're going to right click on rustic amulets, send to priority. And we're going to send it, since it needs to be right above rustic clothing, it should be 686, right? So let's do that, 686. Okay. And boom, it shows up here. Let's double check here. Okay, we're good there. And that's it for the reordering. All right, that ends Mod Installation Part 2 update. Oh, okay, moving on to page 3.